today I'm going to talk to you about the sounds of A, A, I, and A, Y. And that's what our phonics focus is for this week. So when I think about words, I think about maybe the word plane and gain and train. And, and all of those words rhyme. And they rhyme because they have that A-I-N, A-I-N, A-I-N. It's not really the A and the I that are rhyming, but those kind of um, letters put together. Because when I look at away, I actually see two different long A sounds, right? That A, A, A sound. I see actually A, which is right here, making the A long A sound. And then I see A, Y making the long A sound. So we have A, uh, A, way, A, way. And if I were to say which words have the same sound, um, I'm going to look one more time. Um, last word. Let me back up a little bit. Um, I've got way too here. Here. And the A and the I are making that long A sound again. So A, A, I, A, Y, they all make the A sound. So if you see a word like plane in writing, or gain, or train, or away, or wait, you know that the A alone, the A, I, and the A, Y could perhaps make that long A sound. Now there are some exceptions to the rule and you'll find words um, that, that change. Um, and we also have an E that comes at the end of a word that also helps the A say its name as we've studied before. But these are all long A sounds um, here. The first one does the talking, the second one does the walking, we could even say in these two cases, right? Okay, when we look at words like plain and wait, do these two words rhyme? Well, plain, wait, they don't rhyme, but they do make the same A sound, that long A sound. So when we're thinking about words, they don't have to rhyme. The only reason these rhyme is because the N is there to help it rhyme, but they all make the same A sound. And if I have a way, then they're all making what long A sound? All of them are making long A sound because they all have either A, a Y or A I in them. Plain, wait, away. They all have the same eight long A sound.